Hello there, welcome to Car Genix. Today we are going to show you the evolution of the Ford F-150 truck. Let's jump to the video. Everything under the sun is bound to evolve. Our minds, ideas, technologies evolve year after year so why wouldn't our vehicles too? From the very first year the Ford F-150 appeared on the market, it has been redesigned and re-engineered to include the most innovative technologies in order to enhance the passenger's safety and enrich their driving experience. Here is a brief overview of the evolution of the Ford F-150 from 1948, when it was first introduced on the market, to 2022. First Generation, 1948 to 1952. The very first Ford truck was launched in 1948. And before these trucks were ever known as the F-150, they were introduced as the Ford F-Series trucks, including F-1, F-3. These trucks were the first one in the great lineage of Ford trucks. This was the humble beginning of this great story as we know it today. Second Generation 1953 to 1956. For the second wave of Ford pickup trucks, significant changes were made such as the creation of a bigger frame, more powerful engines and an improved chassis. This was also the first time an automatic transmission was made available in these trucks. Additionally, there was a considerable change in the naming convention of these vehicles. The Ford F-1 became the F-150, while the F-2 and F-3 were combined to give birth to the Ford F-250. Third generation, 1957 to 1960. With every generation of the Ford F-150 comes notable improvements and changes, and this generation is not different. In 1957, the Ford pickup truck was reintroduced with significant changes to the design including the addition of a front bender, a style side bed and a steel bed floor. Yet the most significant improvement remains to be discovered. In 1959, for the first time, Ford started to manufacture four-wheel drive systems for its pickup trucks, fourth generation, 1961 to 1966. During the six years of this generation, Ford was fearless and daring and made some very bold changes to the F-Series truck. For example, the body was modified to be longer and lower in appearance, it was also made corrosion-free. The pickup truck was also equipped with a brand new engine, a front suspension system to provide more safety. However, by the end of this generation, Ford decided to revert back to some of its old designs, higher frame, Fifth generation, 1967 to 1972. Ford never gets tired of making its vehicles better. This is the reason why the evolution and improvement of the Ford F-150 continued. In this fifth generation, Ford was shooting for expansion with the creation of several trim levels and also made the trucks more spacious to create more comfort for its passengers. Sixth generation, 1973 to 1979. Ford continued to make comfort a priority with the Ford F-150. As a result, the heating and air conditioning systems were improved. The super cab body style was also introduced for the first time. Furthermore, the position of the fuel tank was also changed to optimize the truck's functionality. Seventh generation, 1980 to 1986. During this generation, fuel efficiency started to become a greater priority with the change to more fuel efficient and powerful engines also enabling the truck to provide a greater towing capacity. The appearance of the Ford F-150 was also modified during these years with a change in exterior styling. The previous chassis was also updated with a larger version. Seventh 
8th generation, 1987 to 1991. The same body style was carried on from the previous generation. However, in 1987, the interior was completely redesigned for a fresh new look and feel. 1988 was also the first year the five-speed manual transmission was introduced to the market. During this generation, the engines gained electronic fuel injection making them more powerful and efficient at the same time. Ninth generation, 1992 to 1997. The ninth generation brought about many changes including a significant body upgrade. This is when the F-Series trucks started to resemble what we know them for today. Additionally, in 1993, the interior of the truck was redesigned. And in 1995, the hood was redesigned. These were some of the most considerable changes among many. Tenth generation, 1997 to 2003. In previous generations, most F-Series buyers purchased the Ford trucks for personal use. Therefore, Ford decided to create two segments for its trucks, one focusing on personal use, with the new F-150, and another one on work, with the F-250 and F-350. The F-150 was designed with a new chassis and a new V6 engine. In 2001, the Ford F-150 was the first pickup truck in its segment to have all four full-size doors. 11th generation, 2004 to 2008. In 2004, the Ford F-150 was re-imaged with an all-new platform and a more angular body styling, they were also equipped with a new Triton engine. Furthermore, despite the body type, all Ford F-150 trucks were equipped with four doors. 12th generation, 2009 to 2014. SVT Raptor in 2010 a new trim level for the Ford F-150 trucks was introduced. This trim was designed to be an off-road pickup. In the following year the EcoBoost engines were introduced because of Ford's growing focus on producing more fuel-efficient engines. 13th generation, 2015 to 2021. In this generation, Ford is still striving to create more fuel-efficient and powerful trucks for its users. In this 13th generation, Ford has also changed most of the body components of its trucks to aluminum, making them lighter and less prone to corrosion. Ford is also introducing its first diesel engine power stroke, available with a Ford F-150. 14th generation, from 2022. F-Series is America's best-selling truck for 44 years for a reason. And now, it's charging into the future with the all-new, all-electric 2022 Ford F-150 Lightning. It's the first ever F-Series that's gas-free and offers more purposeful technology, an elevated driving experience and trusted built Ford Tough capability. Offering an ingenious array of connected, intelligent features with over-the-air software updates to help ensure your truck can get even better over. 4 watching, and if you like this video please thumbs up and subscribe to the channel to watch future videos.